Hello everyone, this is Harry from Iris Communication. Here I am with Samsung SS5830. In this video, I want to show you how you can root your phone and same time how you can install custom recovery system at your phone, the latest version obviously. So, I want to show you this model and I want to tell you something important before doing anything. Okay. As you see, the phone model is GTS5830, GTS5830L, but if you have something else after 5830S or some another thing, please do not try this one, it will not work, so be careful with that. Now, for rooting this phone, what we need to do, we need two file for root and install recovery. I already have downloaded these two file in my PC, here as you see. This is one is recovery 5.0, other is root s, that the root zip, both are in zip file, okay. What you need to do, you have to copy this one and you have to go at the root folder of your phone, that means the main folder of your phone, for example, I can show you here, it is connected. Okay, I copy this and what I need to do now, I have to connect my phone with the PC. Turn on USB storage. Here is the folder. Here is my SD card and I will paste into the root folder I already have but I will click copy and replace again and it's copying now after when it's done I can disconnect my phone safely here at the phone is gone to at the phone also do turn off USB storage battery should be more than 50% otherwise if it stop at the routing process or at the installing the recovery it could be dangerous what I have to do now, disconnect totally the phone from the PC and I have to shut down this phone. Power off. You have to hold the home button and the power button together. For example, as this and hold for a few seconds until the recovery mode is not come. Here I am at the system recovery mode. My phone is rooted and I have system recovery CWM base recovery as you see at the top V5.0 2.6. Okay, you will have four option or five option, not all this. Now we have to root the phone first. For this, what we need to do? We have to go install zip from SD card. This could be little up or down at your phone until your phone is not rooted. And by the volume rocker button you can go up and down and with the home button you can select okay after doing this we come few more option it will say choose zip from SD card the first one is fine and you have to search where you put those zip files here I have at the bottom root gs.zip check at the video description I will put the link so you can go and download for root and recover install recover at your phone okay after selecting the root gs.zip with the home button you can select and here you just need to come at down and click install root dot zip you have to select by the volume button and with the home button you just click and it will install 
it will take 30 seconds hardly and don't panic and nothing else no other option will come and when it will finish it will bring you at this menu after doing this now I'll show you how you can install the system recovery this is important too because before flushing ROM you need a good quality system recovery so this is CWM this is good one okay and this is working for me perfectly without any problem what I have to do now the same process install zip from the SD card but one thing if you don't have install zip from the SD card use the other option that is called apply updates from SD card okay I click install zip from the SD card here one more option is come choose zip from the SD card okay and what I have to do I have to find that specific file here is the recovery as you see recovery 5.0 you just need to click home button for select that and you just need to come down and click install and it will install it will take maybe one minute two minutes don't panic just stay on the phone and nothing else it will bring you to this menu at the top you will see CWM base recovery 5.0 2.6 and all this option reboot system now apply upgrades from SD card and wipe data factory setting all this blah 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 all this option you just need reboot system now the first reboot after doing all these things could take time and you have to be patient maybe one or two minutes or five minutes just relax don't be panic and you will see something new okay my phone is boot and I want to show you this phone is rooted as you see here I have super user this is not any trick it's real okay I don't have no application at the list okay this is all If you have any difficulty, you can leave me as a comment. I will try to answer you as much as fast as possible. In the next video, I will show you how you can flush a custom ROM in this phone after routing. Okay. Thank you so much for watching this video. As always, for more information, go to the IRS Communication www.irscommunication.com.